Hey, what's going on everybody? Stanley Parrish here. Welcome back to the show. I hope you're having a creative day today. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys how to add sun flares to your photos in Adobe Photoshop. Let's go ahead and get straight to it. Woo, here we go people. We're right here in Photoshop. I have this picture right here that I took from an engagement session. Yes, I do engagement sessions. I do weddings too. I don't just do studio photography. <clears throat> but I have this engagement picture right here and I'm just gonna enhance it just a little bit. We're gonna add some sun flares where we're gonna add a sun flare. And I'm gonna show you two ways that you can go about adding sun flares to your photos. So let's go. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna create a new layer I'm gonna take my brush tool. I'm gonna to make sure my brush is nice and soft. I'm gonna set the hardness to zero. It's already set to zero, so we're good to go. And I'm gonna just pick a nice color here. I don't want it to be too yellow, so we're gonna bring it down closer to the oranges. Maybe like somewhere, in, that's good. Oh, we're gonna bring it back up a little bit. Right there. All right, I'm gonna make, make sure it's nice and big. And we're gonna click one time right here in the corner, the top right corner. There we go. All right, the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna change this layers blending mode to screen. And there we go. I'm gonna scale it just a little, I'm gonna make it just a little bit bigger. I hit Control T and I'm gonna drag this out just a little bit because I wanted to cover um, some of her hair, a little bit more of her hair. So about right there should be good. And boom, there we go. That's the first way. That's the easiest way to add a sun flare to your photo. So I'm gonna show you the before and after. This is before, after, before, after. Okay, so here's the second way I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna go ahead and hide this layer. And what you wanna do is we're gonna create an adjustment layer, a gradient adjustment layer. So I'm gonna go down here to the adjustment layers I'm gonna go to the top to where it says gradient. Okay. And doing it this way, you can use two colors instead of one. So I'm gonna choose for the style, I'm gonna choose radial. I'm gonna click here to modify my gradient. I'm gonna bring this closer to the yellows here. And then this color on the right side, I'm gonna change that to like an orange color. Like that. And you can see right here in the middle, we have like this midpoint right here. I'm gonna drag this to the left just a little bit. So you can see more of the oranges coming in closer to the yellows right here. You don't have to do this, it's just what I like to do. I'm gonna hit okay. I'm gonna change the angle. about 42 degrees. And I'm just gonna move the gradient to the top right, just like this. Okay, I'm gonna hit okay. And I'm gonna change this layers blender mode to screen. And see, and the thing about doing it this way, you can always go in and change it. It's, you can easily go in and make changes to it. So I'm gonna double click on this layer. I'm gonna make it just a little bit bigger just by changing my scale here. Oh, that's too much. Bring it back, bring it back. It's about 112. 112 should do it. And there we go. That's it. That is it. I'm gonna show you before and after, before after i mean it looks just like the first the first way i showed you but it's a little different 
just a subtle difference. So before, after, before, after. And there you go. That's how you add sun flares to your photos. Easy peasy. So that's it for the tutorial, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. Share this video with all your friends and family. And I'll see you in the next one.